Hi everyone, welcome to GoFries. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Radeon drivers alone without, without having to run through the whole process and have the Radeon software Adrenaline 2020 running. Yes, uh, for this, for the, all the latest drivers from AMD, there seems to be no option to install drivers alone. In the past, there's an option to, for us to download. Just download the drivers alone or dri download the whole package, the Catalyst package at least. That's what I know in the past. But now there's no such option. When you download and install, it installs every single thing. There's not even an option to select the driver. On NVIDIA's uh, driver installer, you see that there's an option to install just driver alone. But this is not the case for AMD. Two things that are... Uh, Two things consider why you want to install drivers alone. First being if you are a user who just wants to game and does not want to have anything else running in the background, you don't need all the fancy features for, for performance monitoring, uh, performance logging, streaming, and whatever setting else. You just want the driver to run. That's where you want drivers alone, drivers alone installation. And the second being that you are facing problem with your games as such, it could actually be caused by the interface having conflict with whatever else you're running. So in such a case, installing just the drivers alone could actually be the solution so that you avoid the conflicts. You want just drivers alone. So it's lightweight and has far less possibility of conflict. So these are the two reasons why you want the drivers alone. So right now, I'm going to show you how to do that. So this is my uh, device setting. I have uh, um, the AMD RX5700 with me and it currently, currently there's no drivers installed yet. So what you're going to do is uh, you pre-download the driver. I actually pre-download here. So go through the process of installation. I want you to remember this, uh, this, this, uh, this location. So this means you should copy it just in case, just in case the system resets or whatever you want this. So I'm going to save as my desktop. Uh, let's see, location, okay. Just in case we lose it, right? Click install. This is not the, uh, I know the button says install, but this is not the full installation yet. What happens now is it's going to extract, you get to see the details here. It's going to extract everything to that location and even before doing so you can actually start to prepare your installation so let right click to on windows 10 it's a matter of right click on this start button and device manager on which you get to this screen right so when you're at this screen go to display adapters microsoft's basic display adapter right click update driver so in this place search automatically is not the one you click you click this one browse but as you can see after it's extracted adrenaline 2020 edition will appear and it says it is detecting the for the configuration for driver and software i want you to click cancel on this one because we just don't want to go through that there's no option to to choose driver only. There's another install or cancel. You cancel it. Yes, cancel it. Browse my computer for driver software. And the location is here. If it's not this location, copy it and, and copy the location and paste it here. Whatever it is, paste the location. Alright? Or you can paste it here, whichever. Once it's there, or you need to click next. And it will actually install the driver. You see, currently it's not even at, um, even not on the resolution I intended it to because there's no option to change resolution yet un until I actually install the drivers. See, its display resolution is blanked out. Now the screen is black, and now we will get to see the settings. Okay, I want it to be at full HD. Perfect. So there, it's done. I've backed out from all my shortcuts into here to make it a clear desktop. So we're gonna just look for 
the something simple to run let's see superposition let's go with superposition so I was running pre some other settings earlier so it, a bit wonky right now that doesn't matter run so the game will be running it's loading so yeah this is how you get the drivers running see if the driver wasn't installed we wouldn't be uh, running this software superposition is working just fine it shows an amd rx 5700 at the upper right corner with the frame rate going as expected so all right that's it for this video thank you for watching guys i hope you like this um this guide is the, the way to work around AMD's lack of option for you to install driver only. Oh yeah, and before I forget, I'm currently, currently running on a 4K screen with the scaling being very big. So that's why you see Unigine Heaven being that way. Alright, so with the scaling disabled, uh, last thing I need to show you is to confirm that the driver is updated to what I've installed, which is 20.1.4 without the interface so you look at over here it says adrenaline 20.1.4 so yep that confirms the the installation went well so all right that's it for this video you can see no radeon settings nothing radeon related just purely drivers installed all right uh, once again that's it for this one i actually forgot about this part when i did the first first part and so now i'm showing you just to prove that you can have the driver install without the Adre adrenaline 2020 all right that's it for this video thank you for watching and i hope you like this video do remember to subscribe if to this channel if you haven't and i'll see you in the next one bye bye